I see the Aleutians as, as a unique uh, uh, ecosystem. It, it, it may be as, as unique as, uh, as the Galapagos. My first dive out there was, it was just, uh, just incredible. I was spellbound by, by the beauty. As soon as I rolled off the boat and started towards the bottom, I, not only could I see the bottom, see where I was going, but I could see uh, I had incredible light and I could see all the brilliant colors uh, from, from very far away. Uh, many of the dives, uh, you can, you'll have 100 foot visibility out there. Every time I get in the Aleutians, I'm just, uh, you know, it's like I'm coming home again. It's, it's almost as like I'm a kid when I get out there and, and dive because I'm, I'm so excited. I'm energized as I get in the water. Uh, I can't wait to get down, and I'm kind of sorry when I see that my air supply is about gone. I feel like this is where I should have been my previous 30 years of my career. <laughs> The Island of Four Mountains is, is one of five major island groups in the Aleutians. It's a region that has a lot of uh, thermal activity and, and seismic activity. You'll see fumaroles on the islands, uh, and we found some of the thermal vents uh, you know, in the water. It's an area that I try to keep going back to uh, year after year. Several of our new species came from that region. We discovered a, a red algae, or a, a, someone known as a, a rotolith, a brown algae, um, a, a sea anemone, and um, I think there were 17 species of sea stars. There are some uh, really fascinating parts of, of our world. And, uh, and I guess I have hope that the world will, will recognize the uniqueness of this uh, unique chain of islands. And we'll be able to um, have these, these oceans and, and uh, everything that's in the oceans to pass on to our, to our grandchildren. Uh, I think uh, we need to be good stewards of, of our oceans.